Happy Friday, everyone. Um, I'm trying to get this new thing set just right. I think I'm too far away, but I should be. Jason's friend has a camera for sale, so we'll be getting it. Oh, let me. I'm Erica, LOL, Beauty and Reviews. Um, welcome. Turn it down. That would be Eric. Let me see it. He comes and visits us. when he wants something. Eric, go get more milk. Um, I've been missing. This is like a Friday video. Um, Y'all would have seen a video yesterday. Go get more milk. Here. Go get more milk. Y'all would have seen a video yesterday. Um, today we're going to use this Believe Beauty. I mean, not Believe Beauty. This um, You Can Be stuff that came in a mystery box I did a while back. And also some other new stuff while doing a chit chat. This is my little palette. I'm going to put on some of this. Um, as you can tell, it's been a minute. Get your lid. <clears throat> he's not listening. He's going to take this cup, and then he's going to want to come right back and get more milk. Here, Eric. Because he's not listening, so he's not paying attention to the fact I said go get more. Um, so welcome to my real channel. <laughs> you get real. He finally listened. Hey, uh, uh, come here. And you know he's been following me and outside and everything else. And hasn't once asked for milk till I sit down in front of the camera with y'all. Yeah, that's my life I'm breaking out um, this will be going up on the second I'm recording it on the first and I'm trying to figure out how to make it different but I can't right now so we are going to it's a new stand there'll be a video of that going up very soon because I did do that because I could sit on the floor and put it together um, there was a misunderstanding in the last video when I said I had been in an accident. Um, I will put up a thing that shows um, what happened. <laughs> I was in my front yard. I wasn't in a car. And I was helping my stepdad um, cut down our big tree. We have a huge tree that was in the front yard. Let me go ahead and start this makeup look while I'm talking. Um... If, and if you've been here for any amount of time, you probably have already figured out what happened. <laughs> um, because I'm a klutz, I was carrying a large log and um, there is some roots in the yard that my foot got caught in and it went crack, crack. Yeah. It, I, we don't think it's broke. <laughs> Um, the doctor doesn't think it's broke. She couldn't see anything on the x-ray. So it's like a wait and tell. Yesterday I came to come in here to do this. And my foot said, no you're not. And all of a sudden these pains came from all directions inside my foot. And sat my butt down on the bed. <laughs> so it wasn't ready yesterday. <laughs> and um, I'm trying to get this primer open. This is a NYX Marshmallow Primer. I got the little one because I wanted to see if I liked it before I bought the full size. I had been hearing some good things about it. Looks like that. So I wanted to try it first. It smells good. Um, we also had Eric's birthday. Jason's birthday, Father's Day. Eric is 12, if y'all can believe that. I'm turning that one down so I feel like I'm not being glared at from all directions and it looks a little bit better. That's the old one over there. I'm trying to figure out how to set them up. So, bear with me. We're working on it. Alright. I love the way this feels. And it smells nice too. Um, so I figured we'd do like a little life update thing. But my ankle is 
the size of two ankles still and it's been about two three weeks and I was like no I'm not I can't I got to get on here yesterday's video would have been the um, announcement of the winner and the um, July giveaway so yeah um, but we're gonna use some of this makeup that I got from that you can be box and then we'll figure it out I don't think I wanted to use this on her honey one, so I'm going to have to put it up. My honey, because I think I wanted to see if this was a dupe for the um, Urban Decay one before I used it on my channel. So I'm going to go ahead and put this back over here, and we'll do that another time. All right, we're going to grab the foundation. Here it is. This is the You Can Be Foundation in the shade 02 Nude. I like their makeup. I haven't tried their foundations or anything yet it's got a pump on it it doesn't smell chemically oh, it seems to match pretty well actually so that's not bad it's just dotted on our face with our fingers it looks like it's got like the olive t undertone it might be too dark once I start rubbing it in so we're just gonna grab the um why no we're not gonna grab that one that one looks a little rough um where is the brush i wanted to grab it was literally here earlier and it's literally on the floor which means i have to clean it all right let's grab the um okay where is it at? We're going to grab this beauty blender right here. It's one of my favorite kinds. We also have um, a piece of the um, Yayo little sponge. Um, let me know what kind of um, stuff y'all want in a back to school giveaway. I know everybody's having a rough time. Like, would you rather it focus more on school supplies or um, with just a little bit of makeup or focus more on skincare and makeup and hair and all that? I mean, I, I don't have a ton of money, but I have some to be able to buy a few things. Well, not a few. If I get it from the right spots, I could get quite a bit like if they have another boxy charm sale on their website before then which they might I should have been paying more attention to it last time but I was kind of hurt and not really worried about it but I do try to watch the sales so that I can find nice things for y'all also in the catching up department I was outside earlier in my garden after the flooding we had I don't know if I I can't put the video up because I cussed in it <laughs> um, I, I'm gonna try to put like a little montage together of a couple of life little 19 second videos and um, photos I've taken over the last two weeks it rained one day and it felt like Hurricane Harvey because the water was literally like I had to move the car through the water to get it out of the water if that makes sense I had to back it up in the yard because it was almost to the house and they said they had fixed our drainage but obviously they hadn't so it was very interesting but ever since then there's been ants all in my vegetables so if anybody knows how to keep ants out of your vegetables let me know but I was out there and I was trying to move the one of the replant one of the tomato plants because it just looked like it wasn't deep enough and it was falling over and I cut it down cut it back because the temperature around here they haven't they've been kind of going dormant so I wanted to make sure that it was cut back and see if it would come back and um, I love the way this foundation looks. Y'all see this? 
I mean, it's not super. Like, I can still see the dark spots. Hey, y'all can see it, too, for once. I like this new light. Um, I can still see the dark spots underneath there, but it's like, um, it's almost like your skin but better kind of look to it. Y'all notice that? I'm going to use a little bit of this e.l.f. because I didn't have a concealer in that box. So we're going to use a little bit of this e.l.f. one. Since I'm not able to go anywhere, I'm not worried about contouring or anything. But, um, yeah, I even have pictures of my foot if y'all want me to add those in that video. Um, and I have pictures of the tree before and after so y'all can see what I mean by large tree. It's a running joke that I need to be um, covered in bubble wrap all the time around here because like when we were remodeling the house it was just me and Eric here one day and I um, I was trying to paint the living room so I was up on the ladder the ladder fell or did something and I fell directly on my back on top of the living room table to where it knocked the air right out of me and I literally laid there until Jason got home like 20 minutes later. I didn't care when he was getting home. I wasn't getting up because I was so scared. Because it hurt so bad. <laughs> See, I don't want, like, I'm not worried about brightening, brightening effect. I got to move my foot, so. <sighs> um. Okay. Yeah, I had to move my foot because it was hurting so um i did want to talk about something a company i bought the i got these at a discount and they're on amazon and it's called with memories is the brand and i opened them and i was like man i don't know if these are going to be any good it says they're lip glosses but they're not they are lipsticks they're matte li liquid lipsticks and they all have this oh my gosh I was so impressed with the scent look at this that's one of them look at that watch it is a very very beautiful color And it's such a, um, honestly, no lie, I was not expecting to like these once I saw them. And I'm not sure why. I think because I thought it was lip glosses and then it says matte lip gloss. I'm like, what's a matte lip gloss? That That's a matte liquid lipstick. And I was not expecting to love it. I was not expecting to like it but I do and this is like my favorite one it doesn't say what color it is it just says 200 on it and this one is 801 and it's like um I think these are the shades on the side I'm not a hundred percent because some of them look so similar you see the color on the top this one is just a shade different like well this one is more corally but they have this um cherry I couldn't figure it out for the longest time that was shade 801 um, it has like a cherry scent to it and I love lip glosses and lipsticks that have like a nice cherry scent to them or candy type scent this is 802 and um, this one's really orange or really, really red. Okay, this one's like really red. It's like a fire engine red. It's that one right there. Um, I love them. And you could kind of taste it. Not real bad. 
so that's good. But um, I had noticed this brand already on Amazon because, as y'all know, I love to go on Amazon and look for brands. Like, I'll type in the ones I know, and then I'll say, do you know this one type thing? This one is like a mauve color. It's 806 right there. And I had already started looking at these, and then I saw them on one of the little websites that I had, I could get a discount code for it. And I was like, oh, well, heck, I'll try them out then. I mean, they're not expensive anyways, but, you know, get a little bit of a discount is always nice. Um, on something I was already going to try for y'all. And that one, I don't, don't really know what color that is. It's like a, it might be slightly lighter than the one I got on and this one is um, 807 so that is the set and I love how it comes in like a little gift box I mean it comes in the little boxes but this little box here is like a little gift box I love that because you could just tape it put the little card gift card and give it to someone I believe these were like nine dollars I got them for seven I didn't get much of a discount but yeah, it's um, I've been wearing them like in bed and because let's face it, when you're stuck in bed, you really don't have anything else to do but try makeup or lay there. So I was trying some of the things that came in so that I could do a review for y'all, which is why this one just kind of popped in because I also didn't have a lipstick here. So, oh yeah, I did. These are the You Can Be lipsticks. These are not liquid lipsticks. These are, but there's that one. I haven't put these on in a while. So I can't honestly, but like one's matte and one's a glossy. They don't smell bad. We will see if we can get this off our lips in a little while after we put the rest of our makeup on. I haven't put the powder on, so but it didn't crease underneath it doesn't look like all right let's go ahead and put the powder on i'm going to use some believe beauty powder it's um since you can be somewhat a cheaper brand we're going to use the believe powder from the dollar store on netflix i've been watching um lost in space the Great British Bake Off. Um, and then, like, we got Discovery Plus because, believe it or not, that is not that expensive. It's like $7.99 and you won't get commercials. And it's like $5.99 and you get commercials. So, it's not bad. I didn't know if I told y'all that we went from having cable to just internet and house phone because... I don't know. I'm not sure about the house phone. I think we just kept it because his parents had it for so long and some of their friends call, call that way to check on us and check on Jason and all that. But, um, wow. So, we have Netflix. We have Hulu that comes through our phone. Well, from our phone. It's like a thing that was included in our plan I don't know if I could use this one either I think this one is similar to another this gold luster by prism makeup I think this is similar to a um, uh, what's it called uh, Anastasia palette so I wasn't gonna use this one as a until I look either so we're gonna go ahead and put this one back over here as well that leaves us one one whole palette Okay, but it's the print remodeling palette, and the remodeling palette has an orgasm, a peach orange bronzer. See, it's like literally a face palette with the stuff for your eyes. So, um, we're gonna go ahead and grab. I don't. They. I didn't get a. I don't believe. I'm looking to see if I have one. If I have a. Um, I'm just going to use this wet and wild one to do our eyebrows. Uh, 
My hair has been growing so fast. I'm going to show it to y'all in a minute because I did dye it and Eric did get in the way, but I'll add that video in with the other videos that I started it. And, um, he did have a problem, but as you can tell, I don't see a big difference. I mean, I do on the top. I'm not going to lie. But the rest of the hair, does it look... Does it look purple to y'all? Because, I mean, it kind of just looks a bit lighter. I'll show y'all the top in a second. It's already started to grow out because I am still a non-smoker. I'm very excited about that. It's been about two and a half months. I'm almost at the three-month mark. Very excited. After I get past the three month mark, I'm going to stop drinking sodas as much. Um, Y'all have met, seen Eric if you've been here a while. So if you think I'm giving caffeine up all the way, don't hold your breath. I'm just going to give up the sodas. It has a lot of sodium in it and I just don't think it's for me anymore. So, yeah. All right, so we're going to use these bronzers. Well, let me show you the top. You see what I mean? Like something's not, something didn't go right. I don't know what could have possibly not gone right because I followed the directions, but it's like really light on top and the rest of it is in the sun, you could kind of see a tinge of purple, but on the top, it's like red, almost like it just messed up. So I'm waiting about another month or so, and I'll dye it back, just my natural hair color, and be done. I still have a box of the purple stuff, because I thought I needed two boxes, and I didn't. Um, possibly. Maybe that's the problem, that I needed two boxes, and I didn't use two boxes. Who knows? Let's see. This is like a shiny bronzer. And this is a shiny blush. That's really light. We may or may not use these right now. But we got blushes and bronzers in there. So we're going to go ahead and grab the um, this brush from Miascos. And we're going to go into medium. Let me... Yeah. We're just going to bronze it up. Let's pick up this palette so I can see different in the mirror. Okay, it is showing up. I don't know if y'all could see it. Um, I do have to figure out this whole bring this forward thing. I'm not sure why it didn't come any closer. But there's two other things that can hold it. So we may end up using those because they bend towards me. So I'll be able to make you come closer. And um, last week I did come in here while I was doing these um, this light thing and I walked out of here and my hallway looked like a murder scene I don't know what Eric had done to his foot but there was blood all down the hallway puddles of it in the bedrooms and the living room he never cried um, and it was just a simple look like his skin came off his, um, one of his toes, like he had stubbed his toe or something, but he bled so, so bad. I was like, okay. Oh, oh. 
Um, what do y'all suggest on Hulu and stuff? I know I'm bouncing all over. I'm just so excited to be back. Yeah. There you go, Ashley. <laughs> if you're here. Um, he still comes in and turns the light up. All right, we're going to go in the double gleam for the highlighter. I'm going to swatch these for you, too. Wow. I know that's Ashley's favorite part when he comes in and turns the light on. Way up. Um, let's go ahead and set these. We're going to use this um, Maven Beauty Rose Water. I've been using this. Mostly because I love how it feels going on my skin. Um, it just has this wonderful soaking in feeling right now. And I love that. We're going to use this little thing. And we're just going to. Put that in there. Okay. Let me grab this makeup eraser. And wipe this hand clean so I could swatch these bronzers for you this one says bronzer this one says medium medium bronzer the bronzer just kind of blends in with my skin this one says orgasm and this says peach orange orgasm is a shiny one and then there's double gleam and white I'm guessing white because it says WT and I'm thinking the WT, the white one, is literally just a, um, like a white powder. Because I don't see no shine to it, really. All right, we're going to go in. I'm going to do the Omega, Fresco, Koala, Lumpar, DGAF. Lumpar, DGAF, and Cowboy. Cowboy is just a glitter. So that's um, Omega right here. Fresco, Koala, Lumpar, DGAF, and the glittery spot right here. Let me show you on my finger. This is Cowboy. It's just like a faint glittery color that you could probably use as a anyways we're gonna take this brush this is a um, Alamar cosmetics little brush I've been using this we're gonna take it and put um, Omega on it and I've been using this to put my um, transition shades on Okay, it is showing up. We're going to grab um, the flat brush. We're going to grab the e.l.f. one, I think. If I, I thought I just saw it. Yeah, right here. It's an e.l.f. Um, shader brush, eyeshadow brush. I just want to make sure that this color is where I want it. And it doesn't look like Fresco is going to show up much. So we may go into Medium, which is that shade um, of bronzer that's right there. We're going to see if we could get that to show up in that crease. We're going to use this BH Cosmetics brush for that. Okay, we are getting it to show up just a little. is showing up all right so we got like a sort of a deep it looks like it's going to be like a natural look like this is an everyday take it do your face you can go to work kind of palette is what it's looking like um we're gonna take this flat brush and we're gonna go into lumpar and see if we could get a nice little uh, 
shiny moment on the lid. Let's see if we do better with the fingers. I mean, it's showing up, don't get me wrong. I just, let's see. All right, these shimmers are not wanting to work. Like, literally. Like, I can't get any of them to show up. Or to do what I need them to do. Hold on. Let's grab this one. This Prism Makeup Gold Luster. If it's a dupe for another one, we'll find out later. We're just going to see if these shimmers work. We're going to go into um, Ruby. Oh, yeah, there we go. Because I've never had a problem with You Can Be Shadows before, so I was kind of surprised. Now, there is Fallout I can see. I'm not sure if it's from the other shadow or if it's from this one. We'll know in a minute when I go to the other eye. Let's go ahead and take this brush and kind of blend across the top. Just kind of try to save the look. Let's go back into that flat brush. And then I'll let y'all know if it is fallout from this palette or the other one. And it looks like it's fallout from this one. So you're going to not want to have your face makeup done. Like I said, I've never had these problems with their shadows. I've bought a lot of their palettes in the past. I've never had a problem putting them on. But, um, all right. Let's put a little thing in the inner corner and call this a done look because we're at 20, 32 minutes now. And we're putting Shandon in the cor inner corner from the Prism palette also. And we're putting it on the brow bone. All right. And we're going to use a You Can Be mascara. No, we're not. I don't think. Actually, that might be fine. Okay. I don't think that stinks. I think that's like a green tea smell. I love this mascara. But I do have to go through my mascaras and get rid of quite a few. And I'm going to start writing dates on them when I open them. Alright, let's wipe this lipstick off of our lips, even though we like it. And um, see if we can put one of the You Can Be ones on and call it done. It doesn't look like it's coming all the way off, but we're just going to go ahead and put this one on. It is the same color. Alright, and that's the final look. I'm going to record the next video in a second. I hope y'all are having a wonderful day. I'm sorry I've been gone. I'm going to try to get a few videos recorded this weekend and Monday when Jason's home. So that I can be ahead. And I'm going to try and try and try not to have a problem. Any video ideas you have, leave them below at any time. Any video. 
I love y'all's feedback. Um, glad to see you back. Glad to see me back. I'll see you in the next one, which will be sometime next week. And yesterday I saw you. So I'll talk to you later.